Hey everybody, Rich here. Retro video time, Windows 98 again. There is an app you can get from SourceForge called Kernel EX, or Kernel X for short. Uh, current version 452. If you search for that on Google or Bing, you'll find it for Windows 98. And uh, it obviously installs with no problem. Okay, what does it do? Supposedly, what this does is allow you to run apps that require Windows XP and allow you to run them on Windows 98. Here's the Firefox setup 3628 and I'm downloading the latest version of Chrome right now just to see if this works. Firefox I specifically went with 3628. Now the last version of Firefox that works in 98 is uh, Firefox 2. 3.6 should not work at all. The way Kernel EX works is I can right click this setup file, go to properties, and there's a new tab, Kernel EX. And I can use a specific compatibility mode. So as you see here, I can choose 95, 98, Millennium, NT4, Windows 2000, XP, uh, 2003 server, Vista, and uh, I will choose Service Pack 2 of Windows XP as the uh, compatibility mode. This is kind of similar to what you see in modern Windows 7 where you can um, backtrack a compatibility mode to work with older versions of Windows. This one actually <laughs> pushes the compatibility forward instead of back. So it's, it's forward compatible instead of backward compatible. Kind of weird, but well, anyway, while this is downloading, let's give the Firefox installer a shot. Let's see if it actually works. Here we go. If it ever starts to... Oh, there it goes. Alright, so far so good. Custom. Yep. Uh, okay. And next. Default whip. Yeah, sure. Now right now, as this is installing, I have CMonkey, I think this is 1.1.9, which is the last version that works with Windows 98. Yeah. Let me just minimize all this stuff. I actually close this. It's installing. That's cool. Okay, how's this going? It's almost done. Slow download for Chrome probably has something to do with my VMware session, but whatever. Okay, it finished. It dropped an icon on the desktop. Although, I don't think it launched it. One second. No, okay, well, I'll try manually here. See if it actually does something. Okay, I see an hourglass on the cursor. It's thinking still thinking and oh wow oh it started okay don't import and oh I don't know oh wait nope my god, it actually worked. Incredible. Do you want to set your default browser? I wonder why it asked me again. Okay, yeah. Wow, it worked? That's amazing. 3.6 is not supposed to work in Windows 98, but with Kernel EX, as you can see, we're rocking version 3.6.2.8. Alright. Okay, let's see if actually... Okay, this is... God, why is this taking so damn long? Okay, there it goes. Oh, you know why? It's probably because I wasn't giving it priority. Okay. Well, anyway, in about a, a one minute, I will have this uh, Chrome... The latest version, version 23, <laughs> of Chromium. I'm sorry, not Google Chrome. Chromium. 
because I know the installer is not going to work for regular Google Chrome in this, but the Chromium executable might work. Maybe. So we'll see, won't we? In 27 seconds. 28, I'm sorry. Come on, finish up. The reason it's so large, by the way, is this is not an installer for Chrome. This is the whole Chromium. Which you can get, by the way, at download-chromium.appspot.com And you can download Chromium for Windows there. Four seconds. There we go. Finished. Okay. Open this up. And drag this over here. Do, 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 do. This will be amazing if this actually works. I seriously doubt it will, but hmm. at least I got Firefox 326 or 3628. Sorry. Okay, where is the folder? There it is. Can I? Okay, whatever. Okay, let's see if I can find the Chrome. Ah, oh, it didn't extract it right. Stupid. Okay. Let's try that again. Extract to. Oh, extract here. That was weird. I wonder why it didn't extract correct. I can close this. Okay, no error that time. Ah, here we go. Okay, properties of Chrome XC. Use Windows Service Pack 2 compatibility and ah device attached yeah try it again nope that is not going to work well it was worth a try okay let's delete that nonsense yes firefox on the other hand 3628 which is still very usable on the modern in internet uh, seems to work okie dokie. Yes. Your browser is out of date. No kidding. I'm using Windows 98. My god. Now actually, I wonder if I actually have the latest flash in here. I think I did do that with Kernel EX. Yeah, I put in Flash Player 10. So I should be able to view regular YouTube content. How well it works, I don't know, but haven't tried that part yet. Yeah, we're doing good so far. This is way better than using Firefox 2, obviously. So, using Windows 98, if you have to, for whatever reason, old gaming box or whatever you can run the Firefox 3.6 oh cool it works let's see if I can I'm hoping this doesn't show up as too choppy in the screen capture let's see if it actually plays back and just thinking about it oh I hear hey it does work Rock on. So yes, Firefox 326. <laughs> I said that wrong again. 3628. This one. Absolutely doable in Windows 98. It does work. And the Flash Player 10 does work as well. So yeehaw. This will get some extended life out of Windows 98 for a few more years at least until uh, 3.6 becomes, a uh, Firefox becomes unusable on the internet, which should take a while, at least two or three years. Cool!